This week on Country Music Junkies, we have a new artist to introduce you to. I'm so pleased to be joined by Brad Sims. Brad, how are you doing? I am great. How are you? I am doing very well, thank you. Now, for, for fans who maybe aren't familiar with your music, can you kind of take us back to the beginning and, and when you decided to make country music a career? Uh, well, the, the country, I know it's always, it's been in my life forever, and uh, it's probably been about, I don't know, about three years now that I've, maybe a little longer, maybe four, four years that I've wanted to uh, make this a full-time career. Now, how would you describe your sound and your style vocally uh, for people that haven't heard your music before? I find myself more uh, traditional sound, mm -hmm. uh, but yeah. Okay, fair enough. Are there any artists that you compare yourself to or that you think kind of inspire your music or your sound? Well, I, I grew up on all the, uh, like, Marty Stewart and Mark Chestnut and... Alan Jackson and all those guys. Awesome, that's totally. great. Uh, your yeah. new single, Blue Jeans, has just been released. Uh, tell us about that single and, and what fans can expect from it. Uh, well, you know, it's just that uh, when I first heard Blue Jeans, uh, it reminded me of my, my first love. And uh, it wasn't about how good looking she was. It was, um, and believe me, she was a good looker. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Uh, but it was more about her inner beauty, and as soon as I heard, as soon as I heard the song, it brought me back to that first time, and I fell in love with Blue Jeans, and I just knew I had to record it. Okay, awesome. Yeah. Now I understand that Blue Jeans is off of an upcoming EP. What can fans expect from the EP in terms of the the style and and vibe of it? Uh, again, it's it's. A lot of up tempo stuff on there, and just really good songs from some uh, uh, really really good artists that uh, wrote the songs and gave them to me. I'm just you know really blessed and honored to uh, uh, to have got these songs and record them. It's just yeah. Now, Brad, I understand you've been working with the studio on this project. Can you tell us a little bit more about that? Yes, totally. Uh, it's been so great and uh, again a blessing working with these guys from MCC Studios in Calgary. Um, just they're two times CCMA recording studio of the year and and uh, it's just an honor to be working with them. Uh, my producer Johnny uh, Gasparic and Graham Sharkey and Dave Temple and I got a great radio tracker working with Pitbull Production uh, running for me and it's just just a total blessing for me and, a, and an honor yeah just really really honored awesome now if fans want to check you out they can go to bradsims.ca but how are you with social media can fans connect with you on there as well that's right yes yeah Facebook Twitter uh, Instagram yeah all, all that stuff excellent now if fans are listening to your music and they're like, hey, this guy is pretty awesome and they want to come check out a show, what can they expect from a Brad Sims show? Uh, it's always, I always like to have everyone dancing, so it's always up-tempo music and and we're, we're all having a good time on the stage just as much as they are out on the dance floor. That's I'm awesome. dancing with them. <laughs> oh, very cool. That's really yeah. great. Well, Brad, thank you so much for your time today. Again, fans, you can check him out at bradsims.ca and uh, be sure oh. to check out his new single, Blue Jeans.